In a crowded downtown cafe this afternoon, Ross Baraka is speaking to a hometown crowd, and he appears to be feeling it. They want you to focus on triviality and ignorance while they take your schools. They want you to focus on ignorance and barbarism while they take our jobs from the city of Newark. With less than a week to go before Election Day, a poll commissioned by Baraka's opponent, Shavar Jeffries, shows the race tightening. For Baraka, up by two or up by 20, the campaign pace is the same. You seem more animated. Are you getting more into this? Well, I'm catching my second win, right? <laughs> you know, we got about four or five days left in this campaign, and we can't pull no punches. We got to go hard, run across the finish line. As for Jeffries, he's resting up for an important televised debate tonight. His staff says no time for media appearances. It is here in the East Ward, as well as in the North, where Shavar Jeffries has his base. But your base is nothing unless you can get them out. And that, insists the Jeffries team, is where this race will be won. Obviously, the, the East and the North uh, have predominantly, um, in this race, gone with, with Shavar Jeffries. However, uh, Shavar is very strong in, in the South as well as in, in the Central Ward, which is a, a ward that's, that's uh, really split between Latinos and African Americans. The question is, as history has shown in Newark elections, it is often the person with the best ground game who wins. And Mr. Barack is showing even today that he can still wage a very effective ground game. The race for mayor here is never polite. And in these last few days, both sides have been aggressive about accusing the other of political and financial dirty tricks. Yesterday, a Jeffrey supporter crashing a Baraka press conference produced a kind of political street theater that has made Brick City famous. One person conspicuously absent from this race is the man who has dominated the Newark image for the last seven years, former mayor, now Senator Cory Booker, who is not making an endorsement. Not that either camp had sought one. Former Councilman Donald Bradley is a Baraka backer. Corey was always smiling, always laughing, you understand? But he wasn't serious enough, you know. He was going on trips, leaving here, leaving there. Jeffrey's camp says the momentum in the race has shifted to their man and that the vaunted North Ward political organization is peaking at the right time. But with just six days to go, the question is, is it too little, too late? In Newark, I'm David Cruz, NJTV News.